What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Battlefield 5. Today I would like to talk about how EA has stated that the player base has grown a huge amount since the release of Firestorm. And kind of, you can kind of tell it even in multiplayer in my opinion. You can see a lot more servers if you use the advanced server system. There seems to be a lot more servers up and full as of late compared to the past. Now that does not necessarily mean every single server is 200 servers full of 64 players in Conquest on PS4. That's the console I play on, so that's kind of what I can judge by, you know, uh, what I've seen in player growth. Now, I think it is interesting they did state all of this, of course, in their earnings call. If you're not familiar what EA's earnings call is, it's kind of where they get, get together, talk about, you know, what their most popular games are, what kind of, it's kind of almost to show how proud they are of that particular game because it is making money. So Apex is usually one lately that EA talks about. EA has always talked about FIFA because it's always made them a good bit of money. But this time they did discuss Battlefield 5 and Battlefront 2 because of the player base increase that they have seen over the last several months. They said since Firestorm was released, Battlefield 5 has had an increase in over a million players coming back to the game. So kind of the months leading up to Firestorm to when Firestorm was released, that was a 60% increase in the player base. And that is a pretty massive amount. Now, it does seem like Firestorm has slacked off some. And a lot of people judge that by their favorite big streamer is not streaming Firestorm, who once was. And if it's not big on Twitch, it's not, you know, doing well. Or if it's not their favorite YouTuber doing a video on it, it's not doing as well. And you can kind of judge the lack of interest in games sometimes with YouTube and Twitch and kind of by how it's being viewed. But at the same time, that may, may mean that particular large streamer or YouTuber just did not prefer to play that anymore, or that the interest in viewing it has gone down, but the interest in playing it may not have gone down. Those people may not be watching it, but they still may be playing it. So Firestorm was a big thing for Battlefield 5. They did state that it was their largest live servers or live service event ever. Which is not saying a lot because their live service, their free content kind of thing, has not been around that long. But if you think about all the things that have been added to Battlefield games just overall, just period since Battlefield has been a game, even when you paid for DLC, that's still pretty impressive that Firestorm was the largest thing that they have ever kind of put out that has been that popular. Um, and you can kind of see it on the multiplayer side. I think some of it is trickling down to multiplayer. Because I, I play on PS4, I use the advanced server, so I will go in and select, you know, regular conquest, the new squad conquest, search servers in the United States, and I can usually now find 100 plus servers all the time that are, for the most part, all full or, you know, one or two players is all that's needed to make it full. And that is a change compared to, I would say, three or four months back where it seemed like there was probably half that amount of, of servers available to play in. So I think that Firestorm has brought back a lot of people to play. I think a lot of people are still playing Firestorm. I think some of those people are trickling down to multiplayer. Now, in my opinion, what DICE and EA needs to do to keep these players happy is do a lot of work on the multiplayer, kind of like they did with Battlefield 4. Even though Battlefield 4 was not as popular to begin with, it gained popularity later on and became a bigger game than it was when it was released, in my opinion. And that's what they need to do with Battlefield 5. If they can continue to put out good things and quality things, I think they're going to continue to see that player base grow. But leave me a comment. Let me know. Have you still been playing Battlefield 5? Did Firestorm pique your interest in the game again? And of course, if you liked the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. And I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.